In the fall, the JCPS Board of Education voted to install weapons detection systems in all JCPS middle and high schools. The safety screening technology is an added layer of support for the safety and security of students and staff. These machines are already in use at many local schools and Atherton students, staff and visitors will begin walking through the devices sometime next week. In order to prepare you for what to expect and to help lines move quickly, Atherton on Air is giving you an exclusive look at what to expect. When you arrive at school, you will want to remove any binders, Chromebooks or laptops, umbrellas or eyeglass cases. All other items stay in your bag. You will pass these items to a staff member, then walk through the Evolve system, take your belongings and go on your way. Tables will be available for you to repack your things. If the system alerts, you will be directed to go to a secondary screening line where your administrator will look through your things. Alerts happen often because you forgot to remove an item from your backpack or because the system thinks a screener should take a closer look at something. Here are some important reminders. JCPS requires that all students and staff be screened each morning. Doors will not be unlocked until 6.45 a.m. If you arrive before 6.45, you will have to wait outside. The student lot doors for student drivers and car riders will close at 7.30 each morning. Teachers are assisting with screening and have to be able to get to their classrooms. The front entrance will be available for student and visitor entry from 6.45 to 4 p.m. The new systems are just one tool the JCPS Board of Education is using to help schools remain safe spaces for students. Remember that it is up to all of us to do our part to keep the Atherton community safe for us all.